Hello and welcome my fellow operatives. My name is Taft Taylor. Today I got some WWF attitude on the PS1. Let's pick Stone Cold here. We are doing a King of the Ring tournament. It's just going to be about three guys possibly. Just want to see if I could still play this like I used to. Man, this is definitely old school. Okay, we got some Kane, Undertaker, Rock, Edge, X-Pac. I'm going to go with Christian. No. Oh, I want to see. How about Triple H? Yes, the game. And some Mankind, of course. The main guys. Alright, so we're going to start this off. And we're going to do this on Raw. No limit. And start it up. Now, I know this isn't no WWE 2K. But uh, this is how it was back when I was a kid. I remember I, this came out in July or August of 99. Oh! There's the man right there. <laughs> oh, man, he's got that blood shirt. And that, that stank walk he's doing. God, I love this. This is so classic. You see, when I was a teenager, this was the big wrestling game that came out. And this was before WrestleMania 2000 and WWF No Mercy on the 64. This was PS1. Man, look at that. <laughs> he doesn't even close his hands. He's not even closing the fist. Wow. Oh man, Austin. The WWF logo spinning in the back, in the middle. I remember when I got this game, I was uh I was excited for it because the cover's all badass. There's WWF attitude on the cover. And uh I was playing it. And uh when I saw that entrance, oh man, watch this, look at the rock. Yeah, look at him. Look at his little his little stuff. Uh, smug walk as he comes out twisting the elbow <laughs> but yeah I remember uh, when I got this uh, like, here's the case to it uh, WWF Attitude I love this game and uh, here's the back of it inside it all that good jazz so um I remember when I got out, I'm like, yeah, this this cover is badass. I love it. I can't wait to play it. And then I seen how Austin came to the ring. I was so upset. I was so upset. Now, Rock, they basically got Rock down. Look at him. He's a little taunt ass. <laughs> you smell what the Rock is cooking? Rock says. Man, let's start this King of the Ring off. All right, here we go. Here we go. Let's load this shit up. All right. Steve Austin does what he wants when he wants. The Rock Talking is this shit. Champ, there's two things you can do about it. Nothing and like it. Oh, there's nothing and like oh, nothing and like it, huh, Rock? I see if I can still do this. I remember you got to press like combinations, back down triangle for DDT, grab that circle button. Oh yeah. Watch, I'll get the crowd going here in a minute. Ooh, kick it, bitch. Kick it. Kick it. You like that? You don't like that, do you, Rock? Do you, Rock? You little mealy mouth bastard. Look at they're just stomping him. I mean, they did the animations for this really good with uh, certain the moves and stuff, but acclaimed sports. Man, I guess because nobody else knew how to really make a decent wrestling game yet. This was almost kind of in a sort of way ahead of its time. Oh shit! So that would drop. Listen to Shane McMahon and Jerry Lawler. Take it, take it. Yeah. <laughs> oh man, Austin with that front kick, big boot. Oh, with the clothesline. You know, Austin. Oh, take it. All right, here we go. Oh look, I'm just, oh, how you like that rock? You like this one with drops too, huh? Oh shit, oh shit, oh god! He hit me with that neck breaker. How's that snapmare, bitch? Oh, take it. One knee brace and all, I'm gonna beat your ass. Piston like right hands by Steve Austin. Oh yeah, arm wrench. Listen to him cry. Cry, rock. Oh, he's dazed and confused. It's Mortal Kombat. Oh, man. I don't remember ever seeing Stone Cold do a shoulder bla breaker like that. Kick, kick, kick. Hip toss, bitch. Oh, with this press, please say something. 
Oh, damn. Oh, shit. The fuck was that? Oh, shit, the back of his head's busted open. Irish whip. And power slam. Damn. That was like a Randy Orton power slam. High cross body. Oh, 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 into that clothesline. Now the piston like right hand some more. Oh, shit. Damn it, Rock. No! Spine buster. No, people's elbow though. Boom! DDT, bitch. Take it. Take it. Oh, damn. He's doing some Kurt Angle shit. I was got another spine buster. Don't you do it. Don't you. Oh, that's it. My turn. All right, punk. You think you're bad, don't you? Get in that corner. I'm going to stomp a mud hole. Oh, I did a stinger splash. There we go. Mm, 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 mm. Look at that. Ten punches. Rocks down. Back of his skull split the fudge open. Oh, damn. Poked me in the eyes. Oh, shoulder back. When you hit 44 triangle, that's what it does. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Okay, okay. Suplex City over here. Rock doing a German suplex on it. Get off me, Rock. Get off me. I'll see your ass at WrestleMania 15, buddy. Take your WWF title. I remember also when I was playing this. Came out in August 99. You can look that up, by the way. And, um... Oh, how you like my Spine Buster, punk? And one thing that kind of confused me was it's 99 and I know what Austin and Rock were doing and what they were going through oh hit the stunner down up down triangle bow hit another stomp I'm gonna hit another stunner watch this watch this boom bow oh it's over I got pin how do I pin oh shit I hit the wrong button oh shit anyways I remember what they were doing let's see if I get a third stunner oh crap and um, I watched them come out and like Austin has that blood shirt he wore that shirt in oh here we go there it is he wore that in October of 98 so it was, seemed outdated and then his music was if you smell and Austin's music in this is heavier if you can listen, listen to it whenever it plays it <laughs> I win haha <laughs> take that rock so I was like why is it outdated this is last year's stuff and when you're a kid Listen to that music. I like the heavier bass of his music, but they got faster, actually, in October of 98, and then on is the music we all know today. And, uh, yeah. Anyways, w w when I heard it, I was like, man, this, is, this seems outdated. Why is it outdated? But I realized that's just how they do in all the games. They got to go off the previous year when making it to the new one. All right, so they won. Now, oh shit, I gotta face the Undertaker. All right, let's go to Raw. Let's do the No Limit, and here we go. All right, playing some WWF Attitude. If you're just tuning in, by Acclaim Sports, look it up. I got the Black Label. I don't know if they did a greatest hits to this though. Oh, we got Austin coming out. WWF Attitude. Get it? Oh, I got it. I wonder if the inside of this. Look at Austin coming out with his little wristband. <laughs> oh, she give him the double knee braces. Selecting superstars. Look at this old stuff right here. While Austin throws his hands up like he's part of Right to Sister. Look, I still got the, the book. Or the registration card in it. Yeah. Got some notes. I, mean, I never took any notes. I never got the strategy guide. I don't know how you need a strategy guide for a wrestling game. Unless you're just new to it. Superstar biographies. Uh, here's some notes I took. So there was a little typo right here. So X-Pac, I put number two when number two was actually Jerry the King Lawler. Oh, look at the Undertaker. Now that's, this is actually an interesting entrance. Look at his Phenom entrance. Now, that's the other thing. They had him up to par 
because he was doing the Phenom in 99. Right before he left, and uh, he actually left at the end of August, around this month when this game came out. He left for a little bit before he came back the next year as the American Badass. But they got this part down. I don't know. What do y'all think? Hit it in the comment section, comment section below. Now, Claim Sports also did WWF Warzone. They did South Park. And they did some other stuff, which is pretty cool. All right. DTA, don't trust anybody. Don't you tell me to rest in peace. You will die slow, <laughs> agonizing death. Oh, you bastard. All right. I got you. I got you. All right, let's go. All right, guys, we're going to win this. Oh, Ooh, take it. Another DDT. <laughs> I guarantee you nobody watching at home right now can take me at this game of the way I'm playing. Hell no. We should, they should bring with the PlayStation Plus. Take it. Uh, with the PlayStation Plus thing with the PS1 game, they should bring back this game for it and put it online. I'll take any one of you son bitches on. Oh, shit. I also wanted to do this as a uh, 500 subscriber special. Oh, there it is. So, thank you all for subscribing to my YouTube that you have been doing. This is the 500 subscriber special. I don't know why I didn't even say that at the beginning of the freaking thing, but it is. <laughs> Nonetheless, let's get her done. All right. Oh, shit. Oh. I am so sorry. Oh, take that, Undertaker. Man, them Irish whips were tough. I'm sorry. I <laughs> you can only do so much in this game. Oh, yeah, here we go. Check out this double underhook suplex from the top rope. A super double underhook suplex. Couple of right hands. Here we go. Come on, Taker. I'm trying to throw him out of the ring. You hit Ford Ford Circle when you do that. Damn. Knocking him on his ass. Ooh, elbow drop. Ooh. Taker does not like me. I don't even know what difficulty this is on. If it's on easy, forgive me. <laughs> but I did pick it. I think it's on normal. There's that damn shoulder breaker by Stone Cold that I've never seen him do in my life. If any of y'all can find a clip of Austin doing a shoulder breaker like that, please. Please send it to me. Oh, hip toss. Alright. Damn, I went for that suplex. You reverse it bastard. There you go. Oh shit. And I got that bastard bleeding now. Bleeding like a stuffed pig. Look at the blood in this, y'all. Oh god. I even got his freaking arm bleeding. There you go. There you go, Taker. Alright, let's go back up top. Double underhook superplex! Oh shit. Did y'all hear that? Damn, stomp your ass, you big dead bastard. Man, I would have loved to see Austin and The Undertaker one more time at WrestleMania. Yeah, stomp him. Undertaker in his prime against Austin in his prime at WrestleMania. That would have been dope. Alright. Come on, Taker. Ooh, gut wrench. Samoa drop. The Rock told me I could use that move, so don't get mad at me. Take these right hands, bitch. Ooh, take them. Oh, look at the blood though in this game. I mean, the the, the new game they don't bleed like this. Oh yeah, Luthes press. Talk to that shit. Say goodnight. It's over. Got him down. Can't go. Shut up. Oh, bam, stunner. It's over. But not over. Oh, gotta hit two of them. I gotta make sure he's out, because that's the dead man. All right, talk a little shit. <laughs> and a third one for his trouble. It's it. S is over. One, two. What? 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 All right, bitch. Okay, okay, I got you. I got you. Three stunners and the Undertaker kicked out. You can't kill the dead man. Look at all that blood on his back. <laughs> I won't hit you. Come here. Oh, take it. Don't you kick out. One. 
You like that? Yeah. <sighs> God. <laughs> this is great. Man, this brings back memories. <laughs> I, mean, I was getting ready to watch SummerSlam 99 also when this came out. Hell yeah. It's not that easy. Hey, you can't touch me in this game, but dang, four stunners. Four of them. Damn it, Sonic. Four stunners. How do you... It's hard to do this when you're looking at a camera. <laughs> His fucking legs. Sonic, the people want to see you in the 500 subscriber special. Or around this time, I think it's about 550-ish. 550. -ish, 550. Uh, so, yes, again, and thank you all so much for that. And now we're going to get on to our third match where the finals oh yeah here he comes with his little his little stank walk and his one knee brace that bad leg man I tell you if y'all like this like comment subscribe if you haven't uh, if you're if you're already a subscriber thank you so much because you are a fellow operative and I, I did a vote I did a post in the community tab where I said do y'all want to see more wrestling content on this channel, games included, like this? Or do you want to see just Stone Cold stuff? Or do you want to see vid video game content, just video game content? And the majority of you voted all wrestling content, games included. So that's why I'm doing this. As my 550 subscriber special, there you go. So I just want to thank you all. Oh, and here he comes. It's the man of the hour. It's Triple H DX. I wish they had the Titans right now. Now, see, it's like even when I was younger, the first thing I wanted was entrances because when you play Warzone, all you get is them walking out on the stage for a minute and then they walk to the ring, but you don't see them walk to the ring. Here he comes. Look at that. They, you see them walk down the ramp and then you, all of a sudden they're in the ring and you fight. So you wanted entrances. Boom, we got entrances in this game. Now it's like, okay, cool, we're getting the entrances, but now I want some Titantron stuff. Now here's the funny thing. You get the Titantron in SmackDown and SmackDown 2, but they don't do the entrances. Instead, they just have a walk out in front of their Titantron. <laughs> some shit, wasn't it? <laughs> oh, I love it when you get mocked. Right, hold on, Triple H is going to say something. Yes, I'm ready. Yes, I'm ready. What? Don't. Excuse me? I am not that fat ass guy sitting on the couch playing a video game. And no, what I could. See? Now he's assaulting me. Damn it, Triple H. Now I'm about to kick your ass. For that one fat ass. There you go. Talking some shit. I'm way more man than you can handle. Oh, your ass is mine, buddy. Your ass is mine, motherfucker. Boom. Take it. I'm going to stop you. Now what I... Uh, I'm going to whoop him. And King with that evil laugh. And now you're low-blowing me. Now you see, the funny thing is... Even though we didn't get to hear what Triple H said because of the audio issues, uh, what Triple H usually says is, are you ready? Take that, punk. Oh, God, it was with the freaking low blows, punk. Oh, shit, oh, shit. He would say, for the thousands in attendance and for the millions watching at home and for that one fat-ass guy sitting on the couch playing his video game, Oh, let's get ready to suck it! Oh, damn! Pedigree. Not a pedigree. What am I talking about? High knee. Boom. Drop toe hole, bitch. Yeah, yeah. Take it! So, why they cut that out, I don't know why. I heard it on my end. And I just replayed it back here a few minutes ago, right before I started this, and... Did not hear it. So I'm like, well, it's a copyright thing or something. I don't know. Oh, there we go. 
But beside the point, I am going to kick his ah with the freaking <laughs> he scoop slammed me twice. Okay, here's that shoulder breaker. That old stone cold does take it, and that. Y'all remember when Triple H wore those tights? See, they had him accurate to, an, to a T because by 99, August 99, he was the game now. He was starting to call himself the game. But at the beginning of the year, he was wearing that. Damn, Austin with a drop kick. He had done a drop kick since WCW. And if y'all notice that I have been fighting in my shorts and t-shirt this whole king of the ring. This is the finals, buddy. Take it. I do want to thank you all again for coming by and watching this. And thank you all for being a fellow operative. And if you're enjoying this video, like I am trying to enjoy whipping Triple H's ass, if you're enjoying this video, there you go, with this press. <laughs> um, please. Uh, comment in the section below. Oh, scoop slam. And let me know what other games you want me to play as far as wrestling games. That way I can get them and we can do some commentary on them. I'll start doing commentary on all my games now that I figured out how to do it. Take it! Oh, yeah. You don't like that, do you, Triple H? Do you, you son of a biscuit? Take that! And you little stupid tights! See, I'm wearing, I'm ready for a street fight. Hard Irish whip. And now I'm going to stomp you. Ooh, Ric Flair chop. Woo! And then a stinger splash. Ha <laughs> ha. Now we're getting it. Almost. I'm going to get you here. Come on, gang. Get up. You want to stunner? I'm going to go over here and climb up to the top. Austin, don't go up top very much. And an elbow drop. And that guy just threw his damn leg up. DDT. I don't know. Randy, oh, oh, got to talk a little shit. And there it is. I started. All right, it's over. It took four starters to put down The Undertaker. Two. One stunner to talk to take out Triple H. And now your new King of the Ring, Stone Cold Steve Austin. Ladies and gentlemen, my fellow operatives, I was just playing WWF Attitude on the PlayStation 1. Made by Acclaim Sports. I'm not no sponsor for them. I don't even know what happened to them. But beside the point, badass game. I hope you go and play it. Let me know if you've ever played it or if you enjoyed it. I know it's no 2K, but it is definitely great. But I do want to thank you all for stopping by. And this is the 500 subscriber special. And let's see what kind of video we can get. And when we get 1,000 subscribers, what y'all want to see, lay it down in the comment section below. Stomp that like button if you can. And I will catch your asses down the road. Until then, we'll see you later.